Hello, hi guys, and welcome to my diamond makeup tutorial. To start, put on some primer or moisturizer. Gotta protect that skin. Then move on to your favorite foundation. Mine's Lawn Comb. Next, let's conceal those problem areas. Since Daya's look is going to be very soft, I'm going to go ahead and apply my concealer under my eyes and on my highlight and problem areas to soften my face. Here, I'm putting concealer on my brows to lighten them, but I'm not going to make them go away completely. Onto the eyes. For Diamond's eye look, I'm wanting a very light pastel look using light tones of whites, pinks, and the most reflective eyeshadow colors I can find in my collection of palettes. Diamond is a diamond, and in the anime and manga, she's characterized as very pale with translucent features made out of actual diamonds. Since I'm not a real-life gem, I'm making all of these colors match my skin tone favoring white shades, so please either match the shadows to your skin tone or go for the overall pastel look. This makeup is very weird and abstract, and this is how I make it work best for my face. So please adjust it to how you like and what works best for you. To start, I pack on the lightest shades I can find onto my lid and upper brow bone, pulling the colors to my bottom lash line. Then I shade the creases of my eyes with a very light pinkish purple to give some depth. Next, I line my upper and bottom lids with white eyeliner pencil. Then, with that same pencil, I shade my eyebrows. After that, I use a white mascara to make my upper and lower eyelashes white. I have fake lashes I'm using for this look, and I felt white mascara would better blend the lashes I got. The last struggle begins, so I really, really, really suck at putting in fake lashes. The fact that I got cheap ones from a party store didn't help matters, but these are a rainbow iridescent ones that I felt really matched perfectly. When getting cheap lashes like this, I recommend getting a better lash glue than I did, which was a clear glue that was a lie because it dried more beige than clear. Or you can look around online to buy lashes that are made specifically for the gems from Haseki no Kuni or Land of the Lustrous. A friend of mine also cosplays from this show and they use white eyelash glue which seemed to work pretty well for them but that's another option honestly use whatever lash or lash method or gluing method that works best for you and your eyes and powder foundation then highlight feel free to go crazy with that highlight since you're literally cosplaying a diamond Onto the lips. For my first attempt, I just layered a translucent opal colored eyeshadow to match my eye look. But as I put on my wig and saw all the makeup together, I realized that I looked like the spawn of Satan. So to fix my hell egg look, I added in light peachy pink tones to my eyes, lips, and contoured with that same eyeshadow on my cheeks and bridge of my nose. This really shaped my face and made the whole look come together. I also made eyebrows out of leftover cellophane from making my wig. Put on your wig, or in my case, my helmet. I made my wig using a wig from Epic Cosplay Wigs. If you want, stay tuned for the end card or check out the description link to see how I made it. 
then you're done. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. I hope it's helpful for any aspiring diamonds out there. Also, I'd like to take this time to thank Spotty for filming the intro and outro videos for me, Epic Cosplay Wigs for sponsoring this video by providing this amazing wig. If you guys have any questions about the products used or where to find them, check out the description link below. And let me know if there's any tutorials, makeup or wig-wise you'd like to see in the future. Thank you guys so much for watching and bye!